Hello everybody, little David here, and what we're doing is adding in some fish and checking up on, remember my red belly Paku, Mad Max. He's doing really well. Hi Mad Max. He likes attention. And if you see my other videos about acclimating fish, I have a strong clip here holding the bag open so that the air is acclimating as well as the water and I have here two little tiny here's my finger two little tiny angelfish uh, the size of a quarter maybe let me shut off this light too much reflection here all right so here we are still too much reflection where are those little guys those are guppies in the background angelfish now they're a lot smaller and Paku basically being a piranha it's not a good idea that could be a 699 times 2 mistake he's already looking at him like a shark what do you do I tell you what you do oh uh, grab some fish food and Mad Max, I've only had him a little over a week. Check this out, ate my finger. I'm not supposed to tap on the glass. That's because uh, the people at the pet store don't want to wash the tank, wash like wipe the tanks off. Besides that, it doesn't really bother them. Hurts their ears. They don't even got ears. Mad Max, putting in some food. He's still interested in those fish, but he knows there's food too. There he goes. Num, num, num. Num, num, num. He's a really cool fish. Beautiful markings. Really nice. Uh, he hasn't eaten any of his guppy friends. He controls them. He shines at them and threatens them. But he, he, even one of the uh, guppies here had babies. So there are little tiny babies in here. Really tiny. See that little guy? Bink. He just moved. There's two two in the screen right now. Three. Well, he doesn't even eat them. So I'm pretty confident in these angels being alright. They're albino. Just like my little quarry cat here. Put this right here. Now, you guys want to see me release the fish? I already named them. One's called Destroy an Angel, and one's called Magnum Opus. One of them's a little more rambunctious than the other one, so I called him Destroy an Angel, which is also a name of a deadly mushroom that grows in this area. See him? Peck at that one. All right, here we go. Release the clip. Clip has been released. I put him up here. Alright. Release the clip. Alright, angelfish. Now, stress is the number one factor here. It kills fish. It kills us too, but we're pretty, pretty resilient. Free, free. And so now that Mad Max is distracted with so much food floating around, he's not paying all that much attention to these new guys. Hey, is the other one? And the bonuses now that they're in their new place there's food floating around right away they're going to start noticing that and once they notice that they're going to be nice and comfortable oh. <laughs> close the lid now the reason i got albino ones 
is because I have a moonlight setting here. Let me just shut off the normal light. And actually, welcome, welcome to the jungle. Yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? I know it makes it so dark you can't really see. But see, there's the albino quarry cat. There's an angel right there. And now that it's dark, that really makes it settle in for comfort. And plus it's time, it's dark time anyways for these guys. Around 5, 6 o'clock. One thing... I'll have to tell you about this plant later. Oh, it's no big deal. Here we go. See this plant? Um, okay, so this java fern, see how it's all dead and brown leaves? And then there's this weird little cluster of live freshness. Well, what happens, sometimes people freak out and cut those leaves and... Uh, I don't think that matters too much, really. But what happens is, as the plant dies, it sets this little guy off, and he floats around and plants himself. That That's their life cycle. There's some more java ferns in here. See how at the tips, see that? It's starting to form a little, a little plant. And that, that, that leaf will die and set off the um new plant mad max is just checking out the angels back there but that's pretty interesting about java for i really like that they're back there yeah they're gonna be all right and they get big they'll get as big as mad max eventually and um, hopefully they all be friends. There's so little right now. <laughs> but Mad Max isn't showing any interest. Which is good for Paku. I love you guys. Have a good night.